Everybody just pigeonholes clowns these days. Linking to one solved murder, one in Italy and the other in Japan. Case what are these places the you're making up a now? Victim, no apparent motive, and a costume killer. Said he could supply this, with more it could go Somehow Templar route, it could go Batman route. Really, either way at this point. Tell me more yeah, about the clown. I think it's going to walk the tightrope. The first was Arnold Bellotta, the millionaire pharmaceutical baron. He made his money from amphetamines in the post-war slimming and diet boom. Imagine Boom. Millions of housewives literally speeding their butts off. With Did mother's little helper? Oh, sorry that you didn't know about that joke. He had no living relatives, <laughs> and his fortune went to the orphanage where he'd grown up. The only witness in the case was his Filipino au pair. She <laughs> swears he was led to his death by a snowman. What about the I, hold on, snowman, there's got to be a cocaine Rolling Stone song. Give me a minute. Extreme politician. He inherited his fortune from his father's Almost electrochemical certainly. consortium. He was committed to dismantling Japan. All I can think of is Master of Puppets, but that's Metallica. Give me a moment. Like Yamada was a man of vision. He was years ahead of his time. <laughs> you say so. Yamada is the name of the CEO the of my company. Is this, say, like, now I'm freaking out. Is this talking to me? It really is a Batman a penguin episode, isn't it? You know, I hate to the admit, clown and the penguin. It's not Mr. And Freeze, I, I guess. What, I won't be accepting any invitations to costume parties. I don't blame you for being scared. I am too. But this story could be my only chance of a big break. Or what, what we're scared of death. costume parties? I mean, I, I guess that's understandable. Rosso didn't blink when I told him about the clown. It's as if he already knew. Or as if he glued his eyebrows to his forehead. Like you do. Seen cheeseburgers with more spunk? That's disgusting. <laughs> Must piss off a lot of uh, fast food workers. When I showed it to the concierge, he recognized it right away. That phone is approximately one and a half times the width of her torso. The film I shot at the cafe. Yes, George, it's an enlargement I made. Look what that guy's wearing. It's so last year. The same material as I found in the sewer. That's right. This guy shouldn't be difficult to find. Oh, no? Take a close look at his left cheek. A no, not that cheek. In the shape of a horseshoe. Oh, a crescent moon. Maybe, maybe this calls for some Neil Young. I, I, is a crescent moon a harvest moon or those different things? Oh, there is not much to tell. Well, how did you get into photography? I guess I owe that to my father. He bought my first camera. I was eight and my parents had just split up. Did you live with your father? Yes, my mother went off with her new boyfriend. I don't mind. Papa was all I needed. Four years Papa later, was a rolling stone. Ah, oh, I'm sorry. Well, it's all right. I don't mind talking about him. He was more like an older brother, really. Always joking and laughing. Papa always wanted I should study art. Papa don't preach. That's why I went to college. Here I got you some peonies. Apparently they stand for father issues. I couldn't afford the materials. We were billed for everything we used, paint, She pronounced that as if she was talking about weapons. Mm -hmm. Well, you know, I used to go art school is like that now. The only time I wasn't hungry was the time I did This weapon kills fascists and all that. I used to eat the potatoes. I used to eat the potatoes too. We have so much in common. Wait, what? What are we talking about? That's none of your business. He is a potato named I Pierre. False nose in the sewer. That's Pierre's nose. It has On a first date, monsieur? Inside it. The laughing stock of the world. It's a costume shop near mm. the Gare Saint Lazare. I'll check it out. Maybe the remember glare of the lizard? The costume. Sure. Why can't you put it on, Jean? No way am I wearing this. I look really stupid. Besides, <laughs> you might have had a cold. I have a reputation to uphold. Let me just put it right back on the tip of my penis there. <laughs> I'm going back out to search for that clown. Where? Well, I guess I could visit the costume shop. Good idea. Was this meeting in any way useful? We learned a little about her background, which I'm sure will come in handy when she's, like, kidnapped in Act 2 or some shit. 
address of the costume shop, which I'm sure they have no directories or listings in, in Paris at the turn of the century. It was a rough time, the turn of the century. La Rise du Monde. Oh, don't go back there. Hi ho. Hi ho. Hi ho. Hi ho. Hell, we're gonna Mick Jagger him now. Hey, you! What do you You're want? You're my cloud. <laughs> do you recognize the man in this photograph? No, I don't. I gotta go. Don't let me <laughs> keep you. Hi ho. Hi ho. Hi ho. <laughs> He's still there. Yep. Sergeant Moo, please go away, Monsieur. Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! Clown's movement, Sergeant. Is that so, Monsieur? Yeah. There's a man down the street who saw him crawling out of the sewer. Dressed as a clown? No. He changed into ordinary clothes by then. So, how did he know it was the clown? He didn't. But all the clues add up. Little children can add up. But I wouldn't let them manage my bank account. That's Do you a weirdly astute point, I think. No, Monsieur. If yeah. the guy who bombed the cafe, the clown. This man Dude. looks nothing like a clown. He's taken off his grease paint and costume. Then there is nothing to link this man with the killing. Nothing. Look at those murderous <laughs> eyes. Mm. Fortunately, like even by the turn of the him. century, we've moved away from look at his murderous eyes as uh, mm. probable cause. Dirty tissue. No, monsieur, I do <laughs> That's not. physiognomy. That's right. Perhaps it would the, be better uh... if you put it back there. No way. Oh, damn, if Ron Stoker would have been a fan. If you yes, I stared at him until he died. I know the identity of the dead guy. His name was Plantow. Is that so? You knew him, did you? No, but... We'll know everything there is to know about him soon enough. I'm trying to be helpful here. But Our turn of the century techniques are amazing. See you later, Sergeant. I mean, they seem fairly modern. It might be turn of the 21st century. Yeah. I mean, I assume that's what it's supposed to be. I'm still in denial about that being a thing that has happened in my life. You that foreground has some skulls there. When I was a kid, there was a show called Something 1999, and it was supposed to be the remote future. Face like Space 1999? Yeah, he maybe. looked like a vegetarian in a slaughterhouse. Uh, what does that mean? Blood spatter? Excuse me. Bonjour, monsieur. Please, come in. Welcome. Leave the mundane world Pull behind. Pull up a puppet. Like, what the fuck is up with the skeleton with the see. fucking flamingo on it on a ho cow unicorn? Didn't you ever dress up when you were a child? <laughs> Not that I remember. Not as a skeleton on a cow <laughs> unicorn, for God's sake. I don't think any part of that counts as a costume. I don't have a sister. Possibly the cow unicorn is a two-person costume. I just need some information. Of course. How can I help you? They seem to be lots Maybe of it's remote control. And there's the whole head of a pirate on that I'm table and foreground. Who hired a clown costume from you. <laughs> oui, monsieur. I do not see how I can help. Don't you keep a record of costumes that you've rented out? It's, uh... Of course, no, what the hell is that, uh... Well, then, I'd like to check your record. Monkey Give Island. The names of uh, everyone who's rented Gita. a clown suit. Impossible. There are too many. The clown I'm looking for Guy is a cold-blooded killer. Give me his name. Yeah, but LeChuck. LeChuck. It's LeChuck's I'd actual skull. If I could, <laughs> but you can't expect me to remember all my customers. You see, the clown costume see is the uh, Victrola right behind the Viking helmet. The dog is pissing on it. The dog has his back leg raised. Oh, uh, yeah. Hmm. Uh, That's not normally how the little dog and the Victrola work. How come clowns are so popular? I, think it has something I hear Victrola and I just start thinking of... Uh, Personally, I think clowns should be banned. Peruca salt. Mimes. Okay. Who doesn't love clowns? The band, not not the girl. 
Me for two. I don't like clowns. I don't know anybody who likes clowns. He was here this morning. I think anyone who decides, like, I want to be a clown, you sure this is the man who either very brave or has a death wish. Does this dirty it's tissue just really naive. Help you? <laughs> Stop showing people the dirty tissue. Hmm. Let me smell that. No, gross. Um. Best Imer's yep. number seven, white pancake. Theatrical grease paint, right? Oh, we oui, monsieur. Well, I, la creme okay. de la creme of Cespian accoutrement. Have you sold any of it recently? Yes, two can. Two can, Sam? Are you sure like this a is the man who bought grease paint? <laughs> oui, monsieur. He chose two costumes. Bozo the clown and Seamus the pixie. Oh, but Seamus the pixie. Green pixie costume, Seamus all. A taffeta lining. <laughs> He gave me his name as Monsieur Khan. Monsieur Genghis Khan. Are you sure Khan. this is the same man who hired the clown suit? Certainement, Monsieur Khan. I said, Thanks for your help, that buddy. wasn't Bozo the Clown. Bozo the Clown is a licensed character, and that clown looked nothing like it. Huh? Uh, well, okay. France is a different Bozo the Clown. Probably. Probably should have been spelled B O Z E A U X. I never saw the funny side of electroshock therapy. Eh bien, it is yours to keep. A gift. Do I need a license? No, but I give you a word of warning, monsieur. Don't what? touch your junk Remember with it. Remember to switch it off before you visit the toilet. Fair enough. There you go. Uh -huh. If you use it on your girlfriend, you can call it the shocker, you see? You see, eh? Is is this Moo or do they just all look like that? Both. <laughs> Hello? Who is it? looks like Bjork York. Mr. Bjork Bjork. Todrick? Oh, it's you again. What now? Todrick, why do you the why don't you I'm just hang up? Is called Khan. 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 He suit from you, remember? Mr. Khan. Yes. <laughs> James Khan. Yes, I Delivered the suit to his hotel. The hotel Ubu. Uh, I Ubu. Uh, don't remember the room. Sit, Ubu. Good dog. Upstairs. The second room on the right hand side of the corridor. Thanks, I think Todrick. that was the production company that made Cheers, right? Um. Family Ties? Maybe. One of those. So, does the detective have his shirt open? Or a wide tie that matches his skin tone? Ah. Monsieur Stobart, n'est-ce pas? That's correct. You remember me. The retention of such data is part of my duty as a gendarme. That is our crime is fought through attention to detail, not intuition. Yes, yeah, sure. Do you know a man <laughs> named Khan? He's a shifty looking guy. Look, I've a watched a lot of Hill Street sheep. Blues, so no, I think I know more about man, crime than whatever you Frenchies are up to. Yes. I also saw a Pink Panther. I know you guys aren't very good. <laughs> looks like looks like the detective has like some like a map of colon blockage. One moment, as you do. Did you say ass you do? I did not. That was like he had a colonoscopy and it came out clear, so he blew it up and put it on the back of the wall. Hey! <laughs> Welcome. Hi, Inspector. Remember me? Welcome to Francis' uh, really I stodgy fast food food place. How can I help you? A metal classification system that's the envy of the Bibliothèque Nationale. No tricks, mark you, monsieur. Just exercise. Just as our muscles waste through inactivity, so our minds decay. This but guy no must be a lot of fun and parties. If he was trying to impress me, it worked. He was pompous and patronizing, but he had style. I he came out ask, with his shirt open. I was going to ask him out. You're too late. The investigations have been closed, but I've been taken off the case. 
What about the murderer, the dead guy? It is out of my hands. Don't you want to know what I found out? What is Moo doing? I told you, Moo. Just keeps. The case is closed. Up and down. I washed my hands of the whole affair. <gasps> then I'll have to continue my investigation. Just doing desk push-ups here. No, you must forget the business of the clown completely. Go yeah, back I could to forget the clowns. I wouldn't do as much therapy. Around. Did you find out the idea of the guy who was killed in the explosion? I already knew who he was. I heard that the bomb victim's name was Plantar. Your sources are reliable. He was a big shot at the treasury, wasn't he? Maybe that's why you've been taken off the case. I'm sorry, monsieur. I cannot comment. What was that psycho detective business you did in the cafe? It is my theory that the passions evoked in violent crimes create ripples in the ether. Maybe this is the in turn the of every of century. The possessor of a highly Maybe. Developed and receptive mind. This is much deeper than I'm impressed. it first seems. Can you bend spoons, too? I didn't think a man of your obvious intelligence would stoop to mockery. I've never gotten the whole mind, bending spoons thing. I've like, I can bend spoons. It's pretty mind. easy. I used to get ignored. Do it with your mind, silly. Until I read a book that changed yeah, I tell my mind to Bailey, move my hands in ways that are opposite of each other while spoon is in, in between them. He looked at me as if I'd farted at a funeral. The power of mesmerism <laughs> is a rare It's gift. not so bad if you farted at a funeral, but if the corpse does, that's noteworthy. Uh, Look at that top left picture. It looks like a, an adult with a, a binky in their mouth. Me, are you? Do you find the thought of my probing distasteful? No, I've used <laughs> that line say, before. I'd rather you didn't. I've got more doubts than doubting Thomas when it comes to mysticism. Too bad. I think you would make an interesting subject under controlled regression. Are, are they flirting? I, mess with my mind has I believe it's yet. France. Everybody is always flirting. Do you recognize the man in this <laughs> photograph? No. It's the face of a killer. The man who bombed the cafe? The photograph was taken soon after the explosion. He'd escaped through the sewers, leaving a trail of clues behind him. Circumstantial evidence, Stobard. None of it proves a thing. Look, I don't really know how your jurisdictional system works over here. But in America, this is plenty enough for a lynching. I mean, trial. I mean, as long as he's foreign. I mean, actually, he's from California. He'd probably be pretty liberal. I doubt he's down with the lynchings. Is that guy an Excuse angel? Me? Looks like that little wing on his yeah. back flapped there. Have you something. heard of a guy called Plantar? No. That name means nothing to me. I'm looking for a clown. Are you trying to be funny? No. No, really that, otherwise I wouldn't be looking for a clown. There are no clowns here except you. Do you know a man by the name of Khan? No. Khan! <laughs> it's very important I get to see We're looking him. for clues. I oh. I don't know it. I don't know him. Do you recognize the guy in this photograph? No. Oh, it's the clown. I never saw him. <laughs> Forget it. Now talk to the leprechaun. Uh, are one of these flags the, the, the price Templar rooms. flag? Boy, were they expensive. I... The killer must have been Is there a, a Templar flag? Pay for accommodation like this. I don't know. There's a U.S. flag in the middle. Is this like Excuse all me? the embassies? Yeah. Do you happen to know a guy named Khan? That ain't nobody I know. I'm sorry to be That is not man. someone who naturally has that you accent. Meet a guy called no. Plantar? No, I ain't. You missed your chance. If you're quick, you'll catch him at the coroner's. Your routine needs act, but I'll hire you for three nights in Poughkeepsie. 